and welcome back to the channel on this video i'm going to be riding the lyric graffiti as you see it right there this is the 2022 model of course and today i want to talk about where e-bikes can improve more than anywhere else i think and it's right here in my opinion it's that and the other one hiding right up in there batteries so I'm going to hop on and let's talk about e-bikes and where they can improve the most. And in my opinion, it's on the batteries. And if you think there's some other area where they can improve on e-bikes more than anywhere else, let us know in the comments. I'd be interested to hear what you have to say. And I'm going to tell you, there's about four things about the batteries that I think would be good, but whether this ever happens or can happen i don't know they're just things that i'd like to see uh change improve i'm thinking more improve we all want everything to get better right and i think to me the best improvement that you can make on an e-bike is the batteries and more what i mean by that is there's four areas that i think of first of all safety because we've had so many issues with different batteries having fires i haven't had any or know anybody around my area that's ever had that but i do hear the news like anybody else you know and we hear the stories of seems like a lot in new york but i don't want to pick on new york but that's just an example of where you hear fires happening and uh, so that's one area, making the batteries safe, safer, or safe. And another area would be, and these aren't necessarily in any, any particular order, but these are the things that I'd like to see improve. And another one would be the size of the batteries. Now, I don't mean amp hour size or voltage i mean physical size of the batteries it'd be really nice if they could get smaller and so that's another area where i'd like to see them improve by making them more compact if it's possible so we don't have a great big humongous uh, box if you want to call it that sitting on our bike maybe make it smaller i don't know if this can happen but it'd be good to see that'd be something i'd like to see happen and so that's two things another thing would be the range of the battery not only would i like to see them get more compact size wise but i'd like to see them be able to go even farther like to me it'd be awesome if we could ever have a battery now once again it may be way beyond what's ever going to happen but if you could get a battery that could get you let's say we're throttling only which i'm doing right now on the lyric graffiti i am not pedaling this bike i'm throttling um if we could get to go 100 miles Throttling only, say 30 miles an hour, that would be awesome. So that's the third thing. And then lastly, I would like to see the cost come down um, on the battery. And I don't know, once again, if that'll happen, but it, if it would come down, I think it would help to sell more bikes because I think a lot of people, one of the things that shies away, they shy away from the e-bikes is, is because they're expensive. And if you look at the cost of an e-bike, and then uh, just take out the battery itself, the cost of the battery. Batteries will generally run you, uh, for the most part, between, you can figure, 30 
to 50% of your bike cost is going to be that battery. Now there's better batteries than others, uh, more quality, or there's uh, bigger batteries. Of course, that's going to cost you more. Um, but that's you can. That's a pretty good bet if you look at your own bike, whatever you're riding, and then you figure the cost of the batteries. It's at least going to be around 30%. You may get an exception here or there, but for the most part, you're going to find 30%, if not higher, maybe some, in some cases as high as 40 and 50% of the bike cost is going to be that battery. Mm -hmm. So uh, I think if the price of the battery came down, that would help the cost of the bike be a little more tolerable and maybe people could afford to buy a bike because right now basically to me anyway um, to get a pretty good bike now you can go lower than this but I think to get a decent bike you have to spend a minimum of a thousand dollars yeah you might be able to get other bikes for 700 600 but I think a thousand dollars and up and so let's take a thousand dollar bike you were to just take that battery and see how much the battery is by itself I bet you it's at least $300 for that battery minimum and so that's why that's 30% right there it might even be more it might be $400 so those are what I'd like to see on a bike because I think everything else style of frame you know uh, changes and all that but all the components are generally they're getting a little more powerful but they're for the most part the same thing right you get the oh let's say a 750 watt motor you get a 20 amp hour battery you know you now get on a lot of the bikes you get hydraulic brakes you might get a rack on the back uh, if you get the fat tire bike, you'll get a 26 by 4 inch fat tires, or in this bike here, it's 20 by 4. Um, the controller on uh, the lower end bikes, you're going to get more of maybe up to 20 amp or 20 amp uh, controller. You're looking at 48 volt. So. Anyway, that's that's what I think about how they can improve an e-bike. The other uh, thing I'd like to see on an e-bike's uh, improvement is I'd like to see them come more, because a lot of people ride them on the road. How about they're more road ready? Like come with mirrors. I know you can buy them already, but it'd be nice to already have everything ready to go so you don't have to buy anything extra when you buy the bike but uh, already come with mirrors and turn signals and make the turn signals big enough and defined enough that we can make out what it is and which way you're turning. I think the integrated ones are a little bit too hidden in there, not easy to see. Whereas more like motorcycle style where they're spread apart, they're bigger around. Um, would be easier to see. I think that would be good. But the batteries is the big thing for me. I think there's there's room for improvement. I think they're working on that. All the time you hear about new batteries, you know, being worked on and all this. So um, to be able to go uh, further range, lower the cost, make them more compact, small. and safe those are the things that i'd like to see so let me know in the comments below what you think what would you like to see improvements in e-bikes and uh, i'd be interested in reading what you have to say and that's going to do it for this video and hey if you like this video go ahead and hit the like button if you'd like to subscribe to the channel and support us thank you very much just hit that subscribe button if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified once again, thank you for joining me on this video, and until next time.
keep your wheels on the road.